Hey, good evening. It's uh, Saturday, May 23rd. Uh, we have an opportunity tonight to make direct application of Scripture and God's care and to be thankful that He's in control of all things. If you are associated with my church, Redeemer Presbyterian in South Carolina, uh, you know that our pastor, Bill Slattery, uh, fell off the roof today and cracked seven ribs and collapsed the lung. But it could have been far worse. We, as far as we can tell now, there's no lasting head injuries or back or internal organ issues. And for that, we're immensely thankful. But I want to apply a particular passage of scripture, which will help us think through this and other events. And it's just remarkable how well scripture fits the days of our life. None of it's random. The Holy Spirit designed it for us. And it's a familiar passage, three little short verses in 1 Thessalonians 5, where he says to rejoice always. And that means that in a situation even today where Bill is certainly uncomfortable, it could have been far worse. But we can also rejoice in the fact that God has got this. He's in control of this. He has something for all of us to learn. He has things for Bill. He's going to care for Bill. But as a church, this is a chance for us to come together, trust God. We can rejoice that this is not random. And then pray continually, pray without ceasing. Bill needs our prayers. Our church needs the prayers. And we need to be praying to God to recognize, hey, you know what, this is, this is life. Things appear one moment and they can be upside down the next. I was talking to Bill on the phone this morning and then just a short time later I get a call that he's been injured falling off the roof. Things happen that quickly. We need to be in constant prayer all the time. So we're rejoicing, always rejoicing. We're praying without ceasing. And then the last verse of this little triplet of verses says, And everything give thanks, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. Well, this is an everything event, so we can be thankful to God for his care. Thankful that we still have Bill, and thankful that this is a reminder to us that no matter what our plans are, things can change really rapidly. And we can be thankful that we don't serve a God that does random. We serve a God who is working all things out for his purposes, to bring honor to himself and to bring peace to us. So in this event today that is unsettling and we hurt for Bill, we can see the hand of God in all of it. So pray for Bill. Pray for our church. And pray that our hearts will be accepting of the good, kind providence of God, even when things are hard, so that we can rejoice always. We can pray without ceasing. And in everything that happens, we can give thanks, because this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you and me. And that's a great thought to end the day. So be in prayer for Bill. We'll keep you in, we'll keep you in touch and uh, let you know what's happening. So the Lord bless you and you have a great night. Bye-bye.